Kodesh and we're going into um, Rosh Hashanah, um, Yom Kippur, uh, uh, pre Rosh Hashanah Yom Kippur, and Rosh Hashanah Yom Kippur. So we just want to mention that to you uh, again too. Now, uh, quickly, we'll say these things we're gonna uh, that we have to say, uh, and then we'll write as soon as we can and try to get a charge. We have problems trying to get a charge and problems trying to find a place to speak to you. All right, but I want to tell you that the Americans lie about everything, and uh, uh, our beloved Abedot Nasik Neil um, Romanov and Dodi Imasika Judy uh, Rothschilds and then Ron came because they, they killed uh, Neil and they killed Judy um, they said we saw them do that and as they said we saw them shoot Judy and then Judy um, survived but but Abedot Nasik Neil Romanov he, uh, he didn't survive he talked to us when he was dying he said and all of a sudden they didn't try to kill us all but um, they, they they saw that we were too uh, too um, uh, 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 Big and everybody who we, who we were and were honest and they just said no, bad Americans did something wrong. They just said and they they, they couldn't go with the lie. So they just said they come and try to kill us later. So people are attacking. They have been trying to kill us later. They just said so. You should understand that for the bad uh, USA people and Nazi Germany people because they never liked us because we're good and honest and you know from even World War Two and, and before that they were doing stuff even after that. So all those words are the same. So they just said still trying to kill us and trying to take our things and trying to be in our places. So um now we told you all this before. And um, so um, a lot of before. So um, make a lot of trust with the bad Americans lie about everything. They lie about everything. Come over and bothering us and, and telling all kinds of lies and, and, and doing things. They still keep trying to do that. Here's another lie they told. We told you before. My birth mother was the daughter of Aga Khan III of Persia. She was Jewish. Her birth mother, a Jewish Egyptian uh, royal, also a Jew. Aga Khan was also Jewish. We might let you know that too. Um, our, our blood uncle and my adopted father, Saddam Hussein, Abu Dhabi six Saddam Hussein. He was a Jew, and all of a sudden, Switzerland knew that he was a Jew. Everybody knew that he was a Jew. He was our blood uncle and my adopted father. He was even here, a Jewish man who had the right to uh, uh, enforce our law. Nobody has the right to come and tell you 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 can't get rid of homos and whores or regulate your law. A homosexual whore nation came after us. Call it Magog. Consider uh, that it considered that this is actually it. So they kept from bothering people and doing things. We hid our Abu Dhabi Saddam Hussein. And then he said, I don't, you shouldn't have to hide me. I'm, I'm doing right. He came out anyway. We found him hung from a tree. We told you all this. Now, we told you that the Americans hurt Persia, what you call Iran. Did the chemical attack. Because obviously, uh, Saddam Hussein, um, our blood, my attached father, my birth mother, the princess of the king of Persia, what you call Iran. Also, obviously, Saddam Hussein's relative. So see how much Americans lie? Everyone knows what Americans have tried, tried to do. Uh, our, our relative Yasser Arafat, also a Jew, he risked his life. We, we, Israel tried to rescue him before, we rescued him. He said, no, we have to prove that, that the Americans are bad and they lie. He never did all those things. Then the last time when he was, he was, he was, he was uh, kidnapped and held captive, the bad Americans did hurt him and, and, and we couldn't rescue him. Now, he wasn't one of those things, was he now? Because he was dead and gone long before Shabi and I were kidnapped. Long before my beloved and kids were kidnapped in an organized police thing. Um, so basically, they lie about everything and bother everybody. And our relative, Yasser Arafat, that he was also a Jew. Now, we talk just as we can, because oh, we always get along. We come over bothering, looking for money, trying to do things. It's like a stunt that they always come and they don't have any money. Resisted. <laughs> always come looking for money. So we just let that too. Oh, well, you know, we have palaces in Gestapo. Resisted. We tell the truth. And there was a war in Switzerland at the same time all these other wars. And the thing is effective. Because we're banks, we didn't publicize it. Our relative, um, you probably see it. Our relative, who was a uh, Rothschild's police, he um, had to come here because the bad people were trying to, bad Americans trying to do stuff to our TNT, which is a postal system. But we had to move another place. You know, I made FedEx, okay, Mr. Said, and my beloved can see that I made it with my crayon box, so the colors are so weird. But because we didn't like the postal system, they tried to kill us when they couldn't afford to buy their own training center. And we, they wanted us to buy it for them and give it to them. For those that don't like us, and they do terrible things. And they, they're terrible, terrible things. And they send all the wicked people to do stuff that's so not right. So we got to there. My, my beloved, she came up to things, so they got their things by killing people and taking their things. And, and, and selling your property. And selling things. Okay, so that's said it would reduce us over here to the American Indians. They, the Americans came up and gave stuff like that. And always uh, um, doing stuff to us. We don't like bad people. We're going to go into the future. That we're going to live for eternity. We're the good people. Only good people are going to live for eternity. The bad people told us lies are not going to be. But they said, there'll be no liar left. Our Bible says it too. Okay, and they, they took, make up all of the tell us, tell us stories. And when they when they try to come to the facility, they said they'll, they'll kill us any way they can. They even try to tell the lies that we're American. We're not American. I'm not American and I'm not American. 
We have never been American citizens. We have never been American. We have a lot of stuff. You know, I, I when when um I um, they gave me my checking account. Uh, my checking account was supposed to get 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 on a certain amount of money. I thought about I saw them tear down a house, uh, in another location they were trying to steal with their bare hands. I said I'll never buy anything over here like that. I'll come back. It'll be torn down, and I won't even know where it is. So I said people lie like that. The bad Americans. They were people like this. We like to criminal. And we tried to take them to the Hague. Shabby and I'm a beloved sister. And I, Shabby, took them to the Hague with all the liberal, Brussels family, and our other liberal family, like I was King Hussein, I was like Bunyik Bab, Babazov King Hussein, to the Hague. And we were five years old, and Americans still lie about it. So I said, this one, we're, we're not five anymore, and, and stature and height, but we're still the same on the inside.